Hi, it's Taylor with Two Buttons Deep, and I am sitting here today with Jessica Sheridan of Redburn Development to talk about her Giving Tuesday campaign for the United Way of the Greater Capital Region. Jess, what's up? Hi, how are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. I have been told that you are considered to be the next generation of philanthropists here in the Capital Region, which is a pretty big deal. But before we get to that part, who are you? Who is Jess Sheridan? I'm Jessica Sheridan. I am marketing and community relations for Redburn Development. Um, I'm a Capital Region kid born and raised, and I try to stay as involved in as many causes as I can. What do you think in terms of advice for a younger demographic who isn't really sure how to give or isn't sure how to get involved? What does this next generation of giving look like? I think if you don't have the funds, you can think um, of a time investment. People have time, they have a voice more now more than ever. They have social media. If there's a cause you're passionate about, share that page's social media. Um, do a little video and say why you're passionate about it and try to get others to do the same. I think luckily for the next generation, giving back and being socially responsible is cool, which I mean wasn't when I was growing up. But I think <laughs> I think that, that there's now um, yeah, a, a cool factor to, to giving back and being socially responsible. Where do you see the capital region in the next maybe 10 years? I think that um, with all of the New York City transplants due to COVID and the people from outside the region, I think that it'll kind of uh, force us to kind of step up our game and we'll have new people here who have new creative ideas. So I think that, um, I know people say Troy is like a mini Brooklyn. I think it'll go more in that direction. I think people from the outside will give a new influence. And I think that um, there's a lot of great people in the capital region who work to make sure the area is marketed properly and show all the great things we have going on. So I definitely think it's just going to continue to flourish. And where do you see you, your career, your efforts going in yeah. the next 10 years? I feel like COVID has taught us not to plan. So mm -hmm. like I could say 10 years, uh, more vacations, travel more. Yes, good love. <laughs> Socialize more. Um, yeah, so I try to not like check a box. I think um, personally just focus on like being my, my best self, making an effort to, to give back and not making the excuse of like, I'm too busy to, to do this. So just carving out time to, to give back and remembering how important it is. Mm -hmm. And how do you plan to raise your $1,000 for Giving Tuesday? Any creative ideas? Um, not yet. I think I'm going to like hopefully call in some favors, say mm -hmm. like I, <laughs> I've um, helped your organization and your cause. I'm hoping that you can do the same. Um, and I think that hopefully people that haven't gone to galas or, or these big dinners think that they have these funds that they wouldn't have spent on hair, makeup, dresses, and, and might have that to, to give back if they're in a position where they still have a job and they still have their home and all these things. So mm -hmm. um, that's my, I'm going to think about, like when you, there's a sale, you think about the money you're saving, right. not the money you're spending. Mm -hmm. So you save so much money already, so now you can give some back. Right. To me and my <laughs> specifically to I me. think that's a good idea. <laughs>